Ryan Thomas kept viewers guessing as he made a creepy debut on Ramsey Street in a dramatic episode of Neighbours. The ex-Coronation Street star has joined the Australian soap as mysterious English tourist Raphael Humphreys, a loner with dark secrets and a score to settle. The Jason Grimshaw actor made his debut in a special late-night episode of the Channel 5 soap on Monday, entitled Hit and Run, which saw Raphael appear to stalk Paul Robinson, Stefan Dennis. One eerie scene saw him standing over Paul as he slept, while in another he peeled off his shirt to reveal a back laced with scars. Some people joked that Thomas had been picking up tips from Kai's serial killer Pat Fellin. One person wrote on Twitter, Jason Grimshaw creepily standing over Paul Robinson's bed, he really did spend too much time with Pat Fellin before he left Weatherfield. Um cause Raphael standing by Paul's bedside watching him sleep isn't creepy at all, said another. Many think he might turn out to be Paul's long-lost son. Who is this mystery man skulking around? Surely Paul doesn't have another long-lost son? asked one viewer. There were several other shocks in the special installment, which was set at Todi Ribici's 90s-themed belated 21st birthday and saw the return of old characters such as Eholand, Natalie Basinth. The villain of the street between 2003 and 2007, turned up at the party dressed as Jerry Horner in her Spice Girl days, and was knocked over by Susan Kennedy's car. She has yet to reveal why she is back but fans are convinced she is up to no good, with many asking on Twitter, what is he hiding? There were also tense scenes for Tyler and Piper, as they attempted to go on the run so that Tyler did not get locked up for murder. The final moments see Tyler make a run for it by jumping from one rooftop to another. But when Piper tries to follow, she slips and is left hanging by her fingertips. Fans said they will struggle to wait for the next installment of the soap. One tweeted, that was intense. What an amazing episode though and can't wait for the next ones. Another said, that it was fab can't wait for rest of the week.